Next, I would like to invite Carol Pendergast to present our next award. Our Living Treasure Award. Thank you, Pat. When I first became aware of the Living Treasure Award, I immediately thought of the person that I wanted to nominate for this award. And that was my mother-in-law, Dorothy Pendergast. Dot has had a long career of volunteer work, starting with the PTO at Boot Hill School in the 1960s. As a full-time working mom, she attended meetings, games, and activities with her, daughters, her daughter and her three boys. She was on the St. Lawrence Carnival Committee for over 10 years, and she became a den mother for her son's Cub Scout pack in 1967. As she has remained very active with the BSA, who is the Kakata Council, ever since, serving in various positions on multiple committees. In 1984, she received the Silver Beaver Award from the Council. All the other awards that she has received are just far too many to mention tonight. We'd be here until 10 o'clock. We don't need that. But I wanted to recognize Dorothy as a Council representative for the annual National BSA meeting, and she's an assistant council commissioner, as well as a committee member for the annual Friends of Scouting family campaign. She's a committee member for our Troop 28 in Shelton, where three of her five grandsons are members. She is currently participating as a volunteer in the Eagle Project for one of her grandchildren. In addition to scouts, she is the past president of the St. Vincent Hospital Retirees Group, currently serving as activities chair and continuing to work part-time at the Council Service Center in Derby. When anyone needs her help, she's there. She contributes to every fundraiser that any of her family members are involved in. She has taught her family the value of volunteerism and helping others by setting a wonderful example for them to witness every day. I am very pleased to present the 2009 Living Treasure Award to Dorothy Pendergast. Carol, who are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> I want to thank you very much for all those wonderful words. And who would ever think that when I signed up to be a dead mother for my son David, which is her husband, that I'd still be here today, 41 years later. But you know, it's so easy to volunteer. But I don't have to tell all of you because you all know that already. But I've had a, a fun journey working for the Boy Scouts, and uh, I, I, I know Carol said something about working on an eagle project. That's my goal, to get at least one eagle. <laughs> so that's what we're working for now. Thanks again so much. <laughs>